quick, tasty test. I'm not, I'm scared actually. These have been sitting in our refrigerator for a really long time waiting for this Because I this keep saying moment. no. They are out of date. Are they? Yeah. Uh, best buy, best used by or best buy by ten twenty eight twenty three. So we'll probably just take a single test. And these are Aurora Bora green bean casserole soda waters. Green bean casserole soda waters. We've been waiting for this. Like again, these have been out of date. They don't. They smell kind of like appley. Oh, they don't smell like too beans. bad. I don't, oh yeah, you're right. Like fresh green beans, like yeah. right out of the garden, fresh green beans. Hmm. I'm gonna wait to see if you pass out first. Not great. I don't really like, I don't like green beans in general. I don't like snap beads very much. Um, I don't like green beans directly out of the garden. These taste like green beans directly out of the garden. Like, on the, they certainly don't taste like casserole. They're way more greeny tasting. You know, <laughs> you don't mind it, huh? I don't mind it. Yeah. I, I'm glad it's not casserole-ish. Like I don't taste any. With real sage extract, flavored sparkling water. I mean, it's not terrible. I think it's just the name. They could have called it something else. They could have called it like <laughs> fresh green bean or something. Or, or just like green green water. Green water would work. Green yeah. bean flavor and sage extract. That's it with carbonated water. Yeah. All right. Well, why do they call it casserole? <laughs> I'm, I'm actually okay. Like my taste, fear is over. I would yeah, it doesn't like, taste cheesy at all. Mm -hmm. Like that's what I always think about no casserole. There's no cream of mushroom cream, soup or yeah, cheese or anything like that. I'm mm. kind of shocked that I don't hate it. Yeah, it's not bad. We waited this long. Again, these are out of date by almost a month. A, a month. But yeah, eh. probably picking up some of that aluminum. All right, for a twofer. <laughs> We've we got to chase this with something. Chase here. it with <clears throat> kettle air fried Himalayan salt. Never tried an air fried potato We're chip before. This is the new, fryer new, uh, new thing. Let's try it out. Taking a clean break. Mm, These are not out of definitely, date. definitely potatoey. I hear it. <laughs> there you go. I'm not kind of excited about these. Definitely not drier. There's not the hard crunch. And there's also not that kind of, um, they're, they're drier my than a greasy, a greasy chip. Can I just talk about my cat for a second? Mm. Because he knows we're eating and every day, mm -hmm. if he knows we're eating, he'll like, whack my leg and then put his claw like if I don't feed him he like sticks his claw just for him what can I say so what do you say so, I mean these are okay bars really like I like that they're not super hard crunchy like a lot of kettle chips they have but they're no lays that's what I'm saying well lays isn't their part either they're kind of a little bit more mealy because I think they're air fried. Really? Yeah, mealy? they're not like. I wouldn't describe them as mealy, mm. but they're good. They're salty and potatoey. That's it. <laughs> a little bit light. They're they're lighter. They don't have that. Nothing's coating my mouth. Oh. Five. Straight up. No, non plus. Five point five. Regular potato chip. This stuff. For me, five point five as well i'm gonna give it a six yeah only because i was pleasantly surprised mm. yeah <clears throat> all right there's a twofer